Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, January 13th. Rejoice in the rich treasures of grace. And thou shalt rejoice in every good thing which the Lord thy God hath given unto thee and unto thine house, thou and the Levite, and the stranger that is among you. Deuteronomy 26 verse 11 Thanksgiving and praise should be expressed to God for temporal blessings and for whatever comforts He bestows upon us. God would have every family that He is preparing to inhabit the eternal mansions above and give glory to Him for the rich treasures of His grace. Where children in the home life, educated and trained to be grateful to the giver of all good things, we would see an element of heavenly grace manifest in our families. Cheerfulness would be seen in the home life, and coming from such homes, the youth would bring a spirit of respect and reverence with them into the schoolroom and into the church. There would be an attendance in the sanctuary where God meets his people, a reverence for all the ordinances of his worship, and grateful praise and thanksgiving would be offered for all the gifts of his providence. Every temporal blessing will be received with gratitude, and every spiritual blessing become doubly precious because the perception of each member of the household had become sanctified by the word of truth. The Lord Jesus is very near to those who thus appreciate His gracious gifts, tracing all their good things back to the benevolent, loving, caretaking God, and recognizing Him as the great fountain of all comfort and consolation, the inexhaustible source of grace. If we would give more expression to our faith, rejoice more in the blessing that we know we have, the great mercy and love of God, we should have more faith and greater joy. No tongue can express, no finite mind can conceive the blessing that results from appreciating the goodness and love of God. Even on earth, we may have joy as a wellspring never failing because fed by the streams that flow from the throne of God. Our Father cares, January 13th.